Have you guys ever been starting something new and you're doing great at it, better than you even thought you were gonna do, and then something bad just tragically happens to put you out for a little bit? So as you guys know, on Mondays and Thursdays, I usually play basketball. And uh, this Monday, I was gonna start a new, new program quote unquote, I was going to do change up the workouts and change the days that they were on and whatnot. And I was going to do like five days a week of or working out along with basketball and stuff because I was feeling better and all that. So uh, Dan and I went to, we went up to the gym early on Monday before basketball and then went and played basketball and like halfway into playing basketball, I rolled my ankle pretty bad. It swelled to the size of like a baseball on the side of my foot. So what I'm doing this week, I'm just gonna take the whole week off and just like recover my ankle a little bit. And uh, so next week I'm gonna start it and we're probably gonna do, we're just gonna do focus on one muscle group a day, but I'm gonna do something, try to do something every single day and then take uh, two days off for the weekend. So what I'm gonna do for, I think today I'm gonna go swimming and then I might try to go swimming again on uh, Saturday just to try to loosen up my ankle a little bit and make it feel a little better. The swelling did go down extremely quick though, which was pretty pretty good. I listen to a ton of motivational speakers and uh, one of my favorites, Eric Thomas, always brings a ton of energy. He always says, a setback is set up for a comeback. So don't let little things like injuries and like life destroy you because it'll just, make you that much stronger the next time you want to go at something or do something. Well, when I was losing weight the first time, I rolled my ankle a week after I started doing the P90X program and uh, had to take a week off for that. So I know it's it happens, it comes with the territory, especially because I'm a big guy and I play sports and I move around a lot and all that. So I know it's going to happen. It's just how you bounce back after that. If you still bring the same amount of energy and not be afraid to like what you can do with like ankles and knees and all that stuff is wear braces. When you wear the braces, obviously, it'll make you feel more comfortable. Me personally, I hate wearing braces because I feel like my body adapts to being able to use that. And then if I don't use it, I feel like I'm going to have a more of an injury the next time if that does happen again. So I always try to wean myself off of using braces as much as I can. One thing I do want you guys all to understand about me and this is that like things don't get me down very much ever. I always try to stay positive even in crappy situations. Like even with this, like I, I'm not worried about like if this is gonna hinder my progress because I know I have something else, I have another reason other than myself to do this. Like I want to help out somebody because I know I can help out somebody. Somebody watching this video or somebody who hears about it. Um, I'm definitely going to finish this and get down whatever. My girlfriend calls these vlogs, I just call them regular videos. Just because I don't feel like I vlog during the day. Like I kind of just go to the gym and then I end my videos. But I do hope that I can show you guys that I can keep progress even with having an injury to hinder what I'm doing. I mean, I haven't lost any, or gained any weight. I'm still at 3.30 right now. Even, and that happened on Monday, today is Thursday. So even in that time, like I didn't go out and binge eat. I didn't go out and do this and feel sorry for myself or whatever. I did feel sorry for myself because I hate when I roll my ankles and hurt myself. <laughs> but I didn't like let it hinder my other areas where I was trying to stay consistent like with eating and stuff so that's one big thing because a lot of people when they get hurt or something happens bad to them they're like oh this is terrible this is what's happened or like the people who say like oh I'm gonna start today and then I have like a bad day on Tuesday and I'm gonna start again on Monday we're just gonna redo it no just bad days happen bad things happen it's a part of life anybody who's lived more than <laughs> Five seconds knows that it happens life happens so one thing you always got to do is stay positive and stay to the grind because if you keep going keep grinding it's hard to give up when you've put so much effort into something and that's what has happened I mean I haven't put I've put a lot into this for myself but I also put a lot into it for you guys and when you make it about we instead of me 
you will always be able to push yourself that much farther and do that much more when it's not just about you, when it's about somebody else. If you make one person smile, the world will be a better place. So I want you guys all to have a great day and peace. <laughs>